In fact, the Barbie movie itself has depleted the world reserves of pink paint. I can't even tell you the meetings we've had about pink. Hi everyone, how are you doing? I've made us a brand new colour and I'm really excited about it. So much time and love has gone into this stuff. This is Pinky. It is the barbiest pink that has ever been created. And a lot like a lot of the colors I've made before, it's another protest color. And this time it's all about the corporate ownership that Mattel have over the color pink. And obviously with the Barbie moving coming out, you can't move for pink and Barbie and everything else. But the truth is this Mattel corporation owned the rights to this color and they haven't been very nice about it at all. When I was a kid, they sued the pop band Aqua for making a song called Barbie Girl. So they used this color on the sleeve of the record. That wasn't very nice. Even the judge thought it was nonsense. He told them to chill out in his summing up. Anyway, that hasn't stopped them. They really are quite aggressive in who can and who can't use this colour. And in fact, the Barbie movie itself has depleted the world reserves of pink paint. They've used so much of the stuff, nobody can get their hands on it. They've painted a huge house in Malibu with the stuff, which probably means that if we want to use that pink colour in interior decorating or on our houses, we can't. I mean, this is just getting ridiculous. We've seen it with Tiffany. We've seen it with the Klein Blue. We've seen it with the Black is Black. And it's almost as quick as I can liberate one of these and make them available to everybody, someone else is trying to lock them down. So this time I've taken action and decided to ban Mattel or anyone that works at Mattel from using Pinky, the barbiest pink. Now I know a thing or two about making pink paint. Of course, I mastered the pinkest paint in the world and that is no different in Pinky. It's probably the pinkest, flattest, mattest acrylic paint in the world. It is way better than Barbie pink and artists all over the world can use it because I've got plenty to go around. So it doesn't matter if they want to hoard the paint, hoard the colour, say who can use it, who can't use it. Actually, all of us can use Pinky. Let's take a look at how this awesome stuff works. Give it a good old shake and uh, there it is. Look at that. Lovely flow, incredible colour. What's more Barbie-ish than that? Let's see how it goes down. As always, because it's such high quality paint with so much pigment, the tiniest bit's going to go a long way. Oh, look at it. It's beautiful. Look how flat that is. And that will dry so matte. It's incredibly pink. It's so pink. I don't think the camera will pick it up. It's always the case with these super pink paints. You can never see them on a screen. You really do need to see them in real life. So if you think multi-billion dollar corporations owning colors and telling us how we can use them is a really bad thing, and you want to use the pinkest, most barbiest paint in the world and support the work that we do here, then click below, as long as you're not Mattel, and get some of Pinky today and use it in your work. I can't wait to see what you make with this stuff. I'm so excited. Thank you for all your support. I love you loads. Bye.